So what I'm going to do real quick is show you how we do a flex test. There's two different ways to do it. This is typically the first. It's an SCA standard flex test. What you want to do is clamp the sword at the guard to a table. What I like to do is take the uh, tape measure, show that, and you need a six ounce weight. This is not necessarily six ounce. You're going to hang it here and you're going to measure how much flex it goes on there. That's and depending on the rules, that's the, the dimension you want to know. The other flex test that's pretty common is with a scale test. And what I'll do is put the sword in the center of your scale and push down. And as you'll notice, you're going to bend about that much, about, about six inches or so. The weight's going to go up and it's going to typically level out. So in this case, you, if you can see the numbers, it's going to go to about 38, 39, 40, 41, somewhere around there, and it's going to average around 40 pounds. And I'm going to call this a 40 pound. It's not the most accurate measurement, but it's going to get us really close in the ballpark um, for, this, for the flex measurement. We have three particular sword flexes, um, a light, a medium and a strong. Each one has different circumstances that you're using and we'll talk about that later.